Hello everyone, Morp here. So I am on my alt here, Mr. Morp, and all I have left to learn on this guy is Swift, the reload for weapons. So I am here at Rescue Pick, utilizing the fact that it's double script weekend here to um, go buy a bunch of stuff so I can not have it all just sitting on my mule, making me all chubby. So, if we can see here over on the weapon bench, I will post a little pic of my everything I got so far. Also, a, I'll post a link of a little spreadsheet that I can use that you can feel free to copy. You can manipulate it any way you want. All your own, whatever you want. It's all good. And I can go down here. So everything, I have everything unlocked. I did the math and made sure I didn't miss anything here. But the only thing that I am missing is Swift here. So we are going to cross our fingers and we are going to go through here and ob obviously see if we see anything cool. But we are going to go banana style here, buying the legendary uh, ranged weapons here. It looks like I can buy 97 of them, um, and uh, with scrapping and stuff, we will see what we get. All right, so let's rock and roll. All right. Um, first, oh, we got a reload. Boom. All right. It'd be so cool if we got it on like the first try. I am going to be um, using up all of the script here. I don't know when the next legendary vendor sale is, but one of the main characters that I play and scrap stuff, so go ahead and use it all up. All storm, no. Alright. Vader pistol, that looks like nothing. Good. Got a reload. Oh, it's a crit reload. But we're gonna we're gonna scrap. The only thing that we're really gonna keep are the ones that are obviously amazing. Nope. That's actually like just kind of cool. That might be worth keeping for the raids and stuff. We'll change that zealot into something different. But we out oh, it here. Budget explosive. Not a really good popular weapon. Red stars junk too. Junk. Junk. All I want to see is some load. Got what two so far? Nope. Also, no. Nope. Oop, we got another reload. Oot. Ooh. Well, that one's like just kind of cool on its own. Um, might say that. You might actually want that one. Not a good gun, but eh, any armor explosive reload. I think reload's very good on those, though. Crash. Also, crash. 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 Um, I don't really know anyone that does. I don't think they're very good. Up your full health. In advance, you got some crit and crit filth. Not terrible bad. Oh, we got a quad. But junk. Alright. We had reload on that though. Ooh. All right, crash, reload. That's what we want to see. Oop. If anyone is new to the legendary crafting system, should be looking at these differently. Don't look at the two shot. Look at the very bottom star. Want to have things that have the perfect bottom star because it costs 60 modules to change the bottom, 30 to change the second one, and 15 to change the first. So if you had a perfect first and second, it costs you 60 modules to make it perfect. But if you had a perfect third star, it costs you 45 modules to change the other two. So the important one is always the bottom one. 
like this is a ghost and I'm not a not a troubleshooter an agility crash quad 25 well quad on gatling plasma is terrible because it already has it already has a huge magazine so you're basically just a loop damage the crit bill explosive the crossbow though and though like fast fire rate, fast fire rate. Uh. Alright, so we're gonna not getting very many reloads. I don't know how many things that I've scrapped reload on it so far. And a lot though. Nope. There are obviously exceptions for if you get like a fixer with any armor faster fire rate or quad explosive fixer or something like that well faster fire rate on a single shot doesn't do anything but yeah if you, if you have stuff that's like a perfect weapon well on a perfect first and second start that might just be good to use as is i wouldn't still wouldn't recommend switching out the um a third star but it would still be worth keeping faster fire rate on that 25 25 gotta be a gotta be a freaking Single action. Oh. I'm going here. Got hormones? No. Twenty-eight to go. Forty. Oh. Power attack. Well. Oh no. Um, up and wait strength. I've never actually used a war glaive, but this is like a perfect second and third star. If you know, if this was something I'd want to use, you could, you know, change that to a perfect first star for 15 modules. That'd be sweet. I don't know if this Wheelander took over the spot, is this being the best two hander? Well, let me know in the comments what you guys think about a war glaive. All right. The armor, weapon speed, eh, perception kind of kills that one. Yeah. God rolls yet. I mean, I'd be lucky if I did get 97 of them. However many we got. Here we go. Okay, so for the gonna help organize these, I'm gonna put these all in here. Um, oh, I got a lot of ammo just grabbing them. So I'm gonna put them all in here because I want to make sure that I definitely scrap all of the untradeable ones first. I'd rather learn reload on something that I can't trade than I can be able to trade the items to my other alts to learn put everything here. probably keep the reloads um that one i'm gonna hold on to here i'm gonna label this one z bottom of the list so i can move that over to i don't accidentally scrap it there let's see Scrap that one in here um i think i'm gonna grab that one 25 25 but it's one. Oh, I reload on here okay reload all right reload later crash The reload, we want to keep that one. But how cool would that be if I got the reload on? 
cramps. Not gonna happen. Nope, it's still gonna be cool though. Alright. Yep, let's grab that one. Um, got that one. Right. Heat load. I really didn't have that many items. Okay, so let's all cross our fingers here that I get it off of just a little bit that we got. And cross your fingers. Oh, and oh, I got it on the freaking first one. Wait, oh, sorry, I was stunned there. Did I just get it like on the very first one? No way. Dude, I got it. There we go. And I am done. Rock and roll here. Well, let's here. Let's celebrate here. And I am gonna open up my sheet, and we are gonna color this out. Celebrate together. Here we go. Here's my sheet of stuff learned. And off. Here we go. Whipped. Here we go, and I have everything learned on my alt now. Woot! A little bigger, right here. Very cool, completed. Alrighty. All right on. Well, thank you for watching. I am gonna go and work on my next alt now. Very cool. All right. So make sure to click the link in the description for this um, map here. I have. One which you can copy and do anything you want with it. Made it nice and easy. You got options. I always just, when I learn them, I like this and I just turn them green when I learn them. I just, I think that's easier. But I did give you the option here if you want to, little check marks, get them. And these are separated by armor on the left and weapons on the right. And the ones that, that apply for both in the middle. We have another option down below. This is what it looks like in the Tinkerer's Bench. You want to, you know, count them down as you go. It's, you know, they're in three columns, but they'll all be in one line in the bench. All the first stars, the second stars, and the third stars. Also, there's a list of all of um, all the stuff that you need for the crafting components and everything listed here. Thank you to Randy Star and Bindi for helping me out with this. And also on any of these, you can just hover over what it is, and it will tell you what it does and the materials that it needs. Like arms keepers needs. Small guns and stuff and a you know, weapon re reduction. Alrighty, so rock and roll everybody. Thank you guys for watching. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys on the next alt.